Here comes Mika. Two seconds. Gets it up. Is he fouled? Will it count? It does. <laughs> That's a spectacular shot. Here comes Norton. It's Wilkinson on the ground. Brian Conklin with a two-handed lumberjack jam. Underneath Tom Abercrombie. What an alley oop. The game had already been decided, so he's, <laughs> he's just adding icing up there now. Make it 27 for Tom Abercrombie. He's showing off. But another tight game. They haven't been able to do many of it. As Vakona spins, Abercrombie goes to the cup, lays it in. Breakers lead by two. Good rebound from Gruber, but no, Irvin on the break. All the way, yes, Irvin, but... Well, there's an old saying about that, but I'll get to it in a minute, because we're going to get very close here to shot clock time, and there's a great drive from Reese Martin, and one. That is why Wollongong can spread any defense out. Oh, that's good soft hands from Reese Martin. He has a 30-point game. And the crowd love Shot clock at 10. He's chewing it up. Clark with the ball in hand. Goes for three. Oh, what a play! What a play, Rodney Clark. He did it all. Wound down the clock and wound up the score. Wow. The 8.20, Farrakhan dances his way into the paint. Oh, A beautiful wow. feed with Walker, two-hand jam to finish the quarter. Points and the one personal foul at the moment. Wow. Nice alley-oop in the wow. Conklin. Like it's not dropping for them at the moment. Getting some good looks. Oh, oh nice move there from Markovic. Aided by Crawford this time. Goulding working hard off the ball. Walker gets to the rim and throws it down. Two-hand stuff by contributions here tonight as Farrakhan looks to get to the rim. He got to the rim okay. They want a three-pointer. Goulding for three. Comes up short on the three-point attempt. Walker again on a desperation. Oh! Aim, and he can't oh! in for three. Don't tell me. And Crawford looks to answer at the other end, but Lucas Walker, offensive rebound. With just seconds remaining, he's been able to bank in the three to... Have a crumbie. Manages to pull up for the jumper and knock it down right on half time. Tom Abercrombie cuts. Wilson, guarded by Bruton, takes it strong to the middle and cops a knock no and gets it to drop. Jamal Wilson is having some sort of night. The heat was put on him during... Young, with five on the shot clock, he's got to get a bailout pass quickly. Glidden with a tough fadeaway yep. jumper. Oh my lord! Upstairs to you, Glidden! Oh. 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 Have another look. Wow, that's just beautiful athleticism by Sam Young. Tony Ellis must be playing well against him. Took a big hit from Tommy Garland as well. And he loved it. Came up, showed his muscles afterwards. Here's the replay. Look at outside the line, too. Wow. I don't think he is not taking the first one. Ogilvy to Young. Jump shot is blocked again by the long arms of Innes. Exploring on the other end and finishes. That's a super play on both ends of the floor. It's a great block, took it hard to the basket. Look at this, that's not easy to do. Behind his back, athletic, onto his left hand. That's just an athlete. Loose ball goes to White. Paul Cochran, what have you got? Well, Steve Trevor Gleason wasn't too happy in that, uh, that timeout. He pointed out behind. Hands active, wide. 
Great hands by Martin to Ennis. Jam. Ball didn't even touch the floor. They look like the Celtics in the 80s. Those are coach killers. That's the end of a turnover. And then James. Well, not surprisingly, Perth have gone out of that zone. As Perth with the 360 jam by James Ennis after the steal. Wildcats have scored the last eight points, and that was two of them. James Ennis on the steal and 360 jam. Comes back up with it again. Beal for a bomb three. That's good before the shot clock expires. Big shot, Jermaine Beal. Gets it ahead tonight, and he jams it.